in these problems, we're being asked to simplify these algebraic expressions with something called distribution. So when distribution comes into play is when you have a set of parentheses with a number snugged up right outside it like this one. What this means is this number, including this, this negative sign, so this is a negative three here, should be multiplied by both of the, the terms inside the parentheses. So to get rid of these parentheses, we have to multiply a negative three by x and multiply a negative three by negative two w. So let's, let's just do this much first, and then we'll rewrite the whole equation. So first, negative three times x, you just write that as negative three x. Remember when a number is right next to a letter in algebra, they're multiplied. So this is negative three times x. The negative three times negative two w is a little bit different because the number part multiplies and we have a negative times a negative. A negative times a negative is a positive. Three times two is six. So this is a positive six and then we just stick the w on, so six times w. So that was negative three times negative two w becoming a positive six w. So that's this part that we've just figured out. Let's write the rest of the the problem in. We had a 3w out here and we had a minus 5x here. Now we have some like terms. So any time where the letter part is exactly the same, the terms are called like terms. So we have a negative 3x and the letter part is just x. And here we have a negative 5x and the letter part is just x. So we're adding together a negative 3 and a negative 5. A negative 3 plus a negative 5 is a negative 8. So when we combine these two, it comes out to be negative 8x. Let's do the w part. So 3w and 6w, both positive. We can add those together because the w's are the same. So 3 plus 6 is 9. So this is 9w. So and this is about as simple as we can get it. So 9w minus 8x is our answer. Let's try another one like that. So again, we have this set of parentheses here, and we have this number on the outside of it. So we're going to be multiplying this negative 4 first by 6x, and then by negative 6w. So negative 4 times 6 is a negative 24, and times the x, well, we just the x there. So that's negative 24 times x. Next we have negative 4 times a negative 6w. Let's just do the number part first. Negative 4 times negative 6, that's a positive 24. And then we just write the w there to multiply it to that. Okay, so we've done what's in the middle. Let's put the rest of our problem here. We've got this w there and we've got a plus 6x. And now let's find our like terms. So first of all, I've got a negative 24x and a positive 6x. So negative 24 plus 6 is going to be a negative 18. So this is negative 18x. All right, so that's our x terms. We also have w terms, so a w and a positive 24w. So this w here, it doesn't have any number on it. That just means it's 1w. A w all by itself is 1. You can think of this as, as 1w. We just don't write the 1. So 1w plus 24w is going to be 25w. So the answer here is 25w minus 18x. And that is a little bit of work with um, distribution to simplify algebraic expressions.